Hi guys, welcome back to reading the word and understanding the Bible verse. Today in Amos, I read chapter 5, 6, and 7. And what I find interesting is in chapter 7, when Amos um, says in verse 11, it says, For this is what Amos says, Jeroboam will die by the sword, and Israel will surely go into exile, away from their native land. So what I like about this is Amos is a he's not a prophet. He Israel says to Amos, Stop preaching here. And Amos says, I'm not a prophet, nor do I come from a prophet's son, but I am a shepherd and the Lord has called me to come tell you guys what's gonna happen to Israel and they still tell him to stop prophesying and and get it and and leave they don't want to hear it but it's interesting how they tell him to leave and he says that's why I find interesting because when he says that it says Israel will surely go to exile away from their native land so when they tell Amos to leave God's like okay well, Israel is going to be going away too. And that's exactly what happens. Is Israel goes to a native land. And Jeroboam, the king, dies from the sword. So it's interesting how these people, they still want to live in their own sinful ways. Even though why like, Amos didn't come from a prophet. He was just a shepherd. And they still didn't listen to him. So I find that interesting. I pray that that helps you guys today to just to be able to open up your eyes a little bit and know that God is always there. And even though I see our struggles or difficulties, we may not think or, or think that he's listening, but he is. We just have to cry out to him more and be strong and know that during our difficulty times, we have to understand that God still loves us. He still loves us during our hardship times. Sometimes during our hardship times, we may not seem like everything's going right, but the word of the Lord is true. And that's all we have to understand is that growing closer to God daily will help you get through your battles. So I pray that helps you guys. Stay pray that you guys have a good day, blessed day. Love you guys and God bless.